So can you explain me how to attract good relationship? By looking for the things that feel the best to you in the relationships that you've already experienced. I already experienced my relationship, but I realized that it's not what I am looking for. Well, sometimes you have to live in a house with not enough closets to know you want a house with more closets. <laughs> so how can I know if it's my fault that it is okay, <laughs> but we wouldn't say fault. We would say attraction and humans. When they think of attracting, they think, okay, I've chosen you because you look really good or because you have a lot of money or, 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 or. And I want you to be it so much that I will mold you into perfection, forgetting that that person has a whole point of attraction and a whole set of beliefs and intentions. And so it's not about finding something and making it right. It's about finding the feeling place of what you want and letting the law of attraction bring those components to you. And the law of attraction can bring those components to you in a singular person. In other words, maybe you knew someone who was really funny into the vortex that goes, maybe you knew someone who was really aware someone who was really vivid about life, someone who really saw things and liked things. Maybe you knew someone who had a beautiful voice or had beautiful eyes. In other words, all of those things into the vortex, into the vortex, into the vortex. Now, all of those things are known by your inner being. So if you are finding this and that, and this and that, and this and that to think about that are not contradictory to feeling good, then those cooperative components gather together. And one day that person walks into your experience and we started to say, you take one look and know, but it's not one look with your eyes. It's one vibrational scan and you just know, you just know, but here's the one little tricky part. Neither one of you are finished expanding. There's a very high probability, possibility, probability, possibility, sure thing that this person will expand and evolve to match your expanding and evolving. That's the thing that makes creating so delicious. It's so dynamic. It's constantly changing and you get to keep defining and lining up with what you've defined and redefine and line up with it and then feel your mastery at evoking. You see this person that you've attracted is not only those things that you have highlighted. That's just the part that your relationship is about. So you have to resist the urge to micromanage all the parts. You just have to let the parts be whatever they are while you rendezvous with the things that matter most to you, whether it is a person or whether it is a town or whether it is a world or whether it is a population of billions of people, that's how it works. So should I change the man or should I change my explanation? Well, we're just saying <laughs> everything that you desire is there. You just gotta stop picking out the parts you don't desire. Do you hear that? Everything you want is there and so much more, but it's up to you. It's no big deal. <laughs> Go either way. Thank you. You're hanging in here pretty good today. If you like this video, don't forget.